What's up guys, Ruxin34 back, and today we have Battles of Legend Armageddon, and yeah, I haven't gotten my case yet, but I went out to my local store and I bought these three booster boxes, and then I went to a Walmart right next to it and got all of these. These used to be blisters, but I know a lot of you guys don't like to watch me open. Every single blister takes a little bit, so I pre-opened the blisters. The packs are still sealed, obviously. We're going to open all of this in today's video. It's going to be a little bit longer. We're looking for the 10,000 Dragon or the Utopia. So we want to pull those Starlights or 10k Rarity, whatever you want to call it for the 10,000 Dragon. And obviously we want to pull the prize card, uh, Chaos Emperor, the Dragon of Armageddon as well. That's pretty cool. So before we get started, the video, I'm sorry, the giveaway for this video is a Sublimation Knight, Trap Tricks Trap Hole, and Coach Captain Bearman. All three of these were pulled on the channel. Then a Horus the Black Flame Dragon, level six, and a Stardust Dragon from Dual Power. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, and let me know your favorite card from Battles of Legend, Armageddon. What It can be whatever. It doesn't have to be a Starlight. It can be whatever card it is, some reprint, a newer card, whatever. I also want to remind you guys about the 20,000 subscriber opening. I'll be opening first edition Legend of Blue Eyes, and I'll be announcing the second part coming soon in the next few days. It's pretty awesome. I think you guys will be excited about it. So make sure you subscribe for the 20,000 subscriber opening. It's going to be awesome. And yeah, let's pop into them. We've got a lot to open. Over 100 packs. It's 40 blisters plus 72 in those booster boxes. So that's 112 packs. I believe the secret is at the front. So I'm going to... I don't know if I'm going to do the card trick the whole time. Because it might take a while. So we have Neos Alias. This set looks pretty cool though. I'm pretty excited about it. Flint Lady. The Celt Post. Artifact Ignition. So I don't know 100% like the values and stuff. I know a little bit of the values. I watched the man house of champs video right before this i've been watching this stuff about the uh the values and the ratios and stuff so a little bit so i kind of know them oh there we go I already ruined it secret rare i'm definitely gonna forget that most of the time raw's disciple that's a cool little card it's probably not worth a crazy amount but it definitely was like a six seven dollar super rare or secret rare out of dragons of legend and it also was it also in dragons of legend 3 unleashed i think it was I don't know if they, they didn't really call it three. Oh, there we go. Fossil Warrior, Warrior Skull King. I think this is like an, either a new card or a, maybe it's like, it's just, it's new for English, I should say. That's what I'm trying to say. I don't know what the exact wordage is for that. You guys can let me know. I've already blown this and ruined the secret rare a couple times. So we're just going to go like this. Whew. Glacial Beast, Iceberg Narwhal. I think I'm going to have to do the, the uh, I think I'm going to have to do the card trick. Because it's a little boring to do it at the front. So Glacial Beast, there's a secret rare. Obviously, every pack. But yeah, the secret rares we want. We definitely want the uh, Armageddon. We want Invocation. That's a nice secret rare that we want to pull. There's some good uh, ultra rares, I think, too. There's another Fossil Dragon. The Skull Geos. Skull Geos, whatever you want to call it. I like, I like Geos better. I think it sounds, I think it sounds better. All right. Yeah, let me know what you guys think about this set. I'm pretty excited about it. I really love what they did with the starlights i think it's really cool there's a penguin people are gonna like those number two dark armed the dragon of annihilation there's definitely some really cool stuff in here like i mean just look at that card but uh, i love what they do with the starlights i think that it really um it really gives you a reason to open the set even if you don't really play meta and stuff like me so you just you're like well there's a ten thousand dragon in there that's like super hard to pull it's worth a bunch of money glacial beast iceberg narwhal Right, I mean, they, they've sold for like in the 1800s and they've gone down since then, but they're still over $1,000 at the time of recording this. And you never know what the price is going to be so early on. But I mean, the fact that people are buying them at all, like that high, that's that shows that it's Konami's doing well. People are buying the set. They think it's pretty cool. Secure Gardener, Raw's Disciple again, Medolce Angeli. This was like a $40 card. Not, I mean, not out of this set, but the original printing. So I think it's like three bucks. So that's pretty, that's a pretty nice one. That's going to go in the hits. I think Artifact Sanctum's in here. I'm not sure if that's an Ultra. I think that might be an Ultra, actually. Artifact Sanctum is an Ultra, and the uh, the Rare, our favorite Rare that we always pull from um, Primal Origin is also an Ultra. You want to pull that, too. Flint Lady. And Chimera Tech Mega Fleet Dragon. Okay. So far, we haven't pulled too many secrets that are that good, I don't think. We've pulled the Angeli. That's probably the best. All right. Let's get the uh, the Armageddon Dragon, the Chaos Emperor Dragon of Armageddon or whatever it's called. I said it earlier, I already forgot. Fossil Warrior, Skull King. A lot of the Fossil Warrior guys, I think people were kind of excited about these, but I don't think they're too hard to pull. 
Another one of the, what's the other good ultra? Let me check over here. It's Numer oh, Numeron Network. The Numerons people were expecting to be kind of short printed stuff. Whoa, check out the back of that. That's not good. Hopefully that's not a great card. That'd be kind of a bummer. Secure Gardener. Fossil Warrior Skull King again. So this guy's definitely appearing a lot already. Twice. And back to back, actually. Those two straight packs. All right, come on, Blisters. Don't fail us now. Give us something good. Oh, look at the backs. They're all like this. Wow, I don't like that. That cross of gun. Okay, that's cool. Reprint. Cross sheep. Okay, there's a nice, there's a nice ultra rare. No, <laughs> no the Chaos Emperor Dragon of Armageddon. Check out the back of it. That's a bummer. I mean, the, I mean, just check out the card though. It looks amazing. There's our big pull. This guy's like 50 bucks, I think. Oh, that really stinks though, because he's automatically not mint. Yeah, I mean, like borderline not near mint. So. Cross Sheep, that's a good ultra rare. We're going to put that. We'll put this guy up here. Hopefully we'll pull more than one of that guy because we do have over 100 packs, but pretty nice card. Invoked. Number two, Blackwing. The Polar Penguin Secret Rare. All right, yeah, we're messing around with the Polar Penguins, huh? Whew. All right. Yeah, I do have an entire... I have an entire... An entire case coming. Whoops. I ruined it already, but uh, I couldn't wait. Oh, wow. They reprinted. I forgot that. Oh, Numeron Calling. This is the uh, the $20 card. I was just, no, Network, actually. Where's Calling? Oh, Calling's like 12 bucks. Okay, that's pretty good, too. So that's a good pull. Yeah, I, I don't know why uh, I saw, yeah, House of Chance was talking about this. He was like, why did they put this one rather than uh, Air Neos? But I don't know if they're ever going to reprint Air Neos. They don't seem interested in doing that. So that's kind of interesting. I used interesting twice. That made no sense. What is this? Come on. Okay, that was a good pull, though. So that, that's hype. We're doing all right so far. Flint Lady. Danger Jackalope. This is a pretty good card. I think it's like three bucks now, but it used to be pretty expensive out of the Megatons, maybe? Was that what it was? I think it was the Megatons. Why did I sleeve the Flame Wingman? Or the, yeah, Shining Flare Wingman. Sorry. I don't know why. Speaking of that, I did send my Shining Flare Wingman back to PSA with a PSA 9. If you get to PSA 10, that card is insane. Numeron Wall. And Artifact Ignition. Numeron Wall might be decent too because the Numeron. Those seem to be... They started off really high, I think, and then they've gotten a lot lower. Okay. So far, we've done pretty good. We got the Chaos Ember Dragon. Even though, see, look. Almost all the other cards are fine, and this one has junk on the back, so that's a bummer. Glacial Beast Blizzard Wolf, Secret Rare. Oops. There we go. Yeah, two, two of the cards had them, and one of it was the Chaos Ember Dragon. Of course. Okay, here we go. I don't know what that voice was, by the way. Shining Flare Wingman. Number C1, Numeron Chaos Gate, Sunya. All right. We're about halfway through these blisters. We still have booster boxes to go. We still have a lot, a lot to go. Let's see what we can do. This is going to be a long video. Sit back and relax. Dark Armed the Dragon of Annihilation. There it is. Can we get a Chaos Ember Dragon that is not damaged? Slash whatever you call that. Numbers, number three. Book of Moon. See, okay, I don't know why they keep reprinting Book of Moon. There's, uh... Polar Beast. They just made the Ultimate Rare. They already have like 20 printings of it, so it's a little bit crazy. I don't know if it's worth anything, but it is... I mean, it's always going to be useful in GOAT format and stuff, but it's super weird how they keep reprinting it over and over. So I saw that... When I saw that uh, Book of Moon was in here, I was like, okay, what in the world? Necros of Gun Gear, another Book of Moon. Dark Spell Regeneration. I'm definitely going to... Okay, I'm probably not going to sleep all these secrets. It's taking forever. I'm going to have them in the pile. I'll sleep them up after the video. I'll put the Book of Moon aside. I don't think it's worth too much, but it's nice to have in my goat formats. Quakimaru. Elemental Kiro. Escurida. Escuridao. Escuridao. All right. I feel like I'm reading Spanish again. Yeah. If you guys haven't seen that, check out me trying to read Spanish packs. That was pretty fun. Okay. Come on, Psychic Wave invoked. Artifact Ignition. Okay, we got another one of that guy. What do we have? About 12, 10 packs left here before we hit the booster boxes. Come on, give us the Starlight. Give us Utopia. Give us 10,000 Dragon. 
Here we go. Madolce and Jelly. I'll take that. That's a nice card. Secret Rare. Nice $3 or so. Not bad at all for a reprint set. Okay. Salamangre, Great. Gazelle. Invoked. Su Wait, Sunlight Wolf's in here. That's pretty good. Specimen Inspection. Secret Rare. Yeah, Sunlight Wolf is, uh, that's been reprinted a few times, I think, recently, too. It was a, uh, was it OTS something? It was an OTS as a as a common or a rare, I can't remember. Solid Man Great Sunlight Wolf again. Miracle Rupture, secret rare. Alright, I'm waiting for it. 10,000 Dragon or Utopia. Either one, I'm gonna be hyped. Wait, how about both? Why not both? I mean, that'd be, that'd be pretty awesome. Numeron Network. Wait, is this the good one? Yeah, this is the high value $20 one. Numeron Network. There we go. That's pretty awesome. Not as exciting as Chaos Emperor. I mean, because Chaos Emperor just looks incredible, but that's a nice value pull. Here we go. Go your Guardian. Book of Moon again. High rate draw. The high rate draw. Secret rare. All right. Come on, let's do this. Black Whirlwind, Necroz. Oh, there's O Lion. Is this is that short printed? Danger Jackalow. That's a good pack. Okay, Mecha Phantom Beast O Lion. There's a nice Ultra Rare for you. That's like five bucks, I think. Last time I checked, at least. Oh, don't ruin it. Don't ruin it. Here we go. Oh, Chaos Neos. Okay, first time seeing him. Artifact Ignition Secret Rare. Here we go. Next pack. Give us the epic Starlight Rare. Come on. We haven't pulled a Starlight in a long time. Fossil Dragon. We pulled this guy at the beginning. I haven't seen him much since. I haven't pulled a... I've only pulled one Starlight ever. And you guys want to check that video out. It's pretty awesome. Now it's worth way more than what I ended up selling it for. Um, but it was pretty awesome. And it's been a long time. So I'd like to do it again. Number two. Glacial Beast Blizzard Wolf. Secret rare? What are we down? Okay, no, I was way under. I was way under shooting us when I said we only had ten packs earlier. We had a lot more than that. We still have like eight left. All right, come on, cross sheep. There we go. And a skirty dow. Cross sheep. That's our second one. We're looking for a playset. I think the what was it? The invocation. I was hearing it was two to three per case. So you don't see those very often. So we might not see that one too much. Humor on wall. Glacial Beast Blizzard Wolf. So hopefully we see at least like one of them, I guess. Maybe two. That would be good. And they're not even that expensive. They're only 20, 20 bucks or something right now. Dark Spell Regeneration. Still five packs left of the bl blisters. Can the blisters end it out strong? And give us an epic 10,000 rare. Starlight rare. Whatever you want to. Whatever you want to give us. Fossil Warrior Skull King. We've got a bunch of those Fossil Warriors. They're definitely not short printed. Okay. Come on. Galaxy Worm. Fossil Warrior Skull King. Again. Is that the second time we've pulled him back to back? I think we've pulled him back to back two different times. So that's pretty crazy. There you go. Number C1. Two packs remaining. Whew, let's pull something. Let's pull it. Give us a starlight. Do it. Oh, crap. Judgment, the Dragon of Heaven. That's one of the cover arts. By the way, I forgot to mention. That's pretty cool. There's like four different pack arts now. They just, like, they used to always do the same pack art. Then Toon Chaos had two different pack arts. This one has four different pack arts. So they're getting serious. They're like Pokemoning it out here. All right, last pack of the 40 blisters I bought. We've done decent out of them, I think. Book of Moon. And another Blizzard Wolf. So, not the worst, not the best. Let's see what we got. We did get a, a Armageddon, which is pretty cool. Fortunately, has the stuff on the back. We got a Cross Sheep, O-Lion, Danger Jackalope, Nolche and Jelly, Jackalope, Numeron Calling, Cross Sheep, and Angelly. We didn't get any Artifact Sanctum, so that's kind of sad. Okay, we're going to start with the first box. Where's my, uh, there we go. Here's my knife. And let's see if this is the lucky box. Let's see if the locals hook this up with epic boxes. No, they didn't actually hook us up. I mean, they, I bought them. 
And they were 90 bucks, by the way. These were not cheap. 90 bucks. Paid way less per uh, box in the case I got, but... At this point, these boxes have risen a lot, kind of like Toon Chaos did. Not quite to the level of Toon Chaos, but they are really expensive. So we're going to go ahead and put this box in the back to make it look cool. Like that. There we go. Okay, 24 packs. Let's get the Starlight this time. And another Armageddon. We want to get another one of that guy that's not <laughs> destroyed. Specimen Inspection. We want to get Artifact Sanctum. We haven't pulled that. We want to pull Invocation, Secret Rare, Mecha Phantom Beast O Lion. There we go. And another Ignition. I'm probably missing some good ones. Let me look over. Oh, the C1 guy that I've been skipping? This guy's like 10 bucks. And, oh, the Fossil Warrior Skull Knights? Okay, what is going on here? I'm about to. I gotta look over this stuff real quick. Alright, so apparently. The Really, this guy on DCG Player is like $15. Nope. We pulled five of them. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and pull those out of there. Out of the uh, just random secret pile. This guy's like 10 bucks. We're definitely going to pull those out into the nice pile. And we'll try and... Whenever we pull those from now on, we'll, we'll keep them. I thought that surely they weren't that great if I'm pulling a million of them. But that's a good thing. I'm happy about it. <laughs> that is a good thing. Raw's Disciple again. Number C1. See, look at this. We just keep pulling this guy. But I'm okay with it. Then, by the way, this is just on the front, the page. So if they've gone down at all, I haven't actually clicked on it to see the sales. It's just the average price right now, but they're still way up there. So definitely worth pulling out. Boost Warrior, Skullgar. Oh, I'm putting these in the wrong pile. Of course I am. Okay, so we're actually doing pretty good so far, which is nice because these boxes were ninety dollars each. But I decided, you know what? Armored White Bear, Leon in the comments yesterday. He's like, I was expecting Battles Legend Armageddon. I'm like, well, I don't have my case yet. And then I was like, well, why don't I just go look for more? That's what I did. Chimera Tech, Mega Fleet Dragon. And we found some. So, yeah, thanks, Leon. You gave me the encouragement I needed to go look for him and spend way more money than I needed to on this set. Book of Moon, there we go. And number F0. Book of Moon will go there. All right, so far this box has been decent. Can we get the Armageddon? Artifact Sanctum, our first one. There we go. And Powerful Crawler. Artifact Sanctum. Nice Ultra Rare. Come on, give us some fire. Give us the Starlights. We need the Starlights. Psychic Wave. Fossil Warrior Skull Knight. Okay. It wasn't him, right? It was the other one. It was the Skull King. Yeah, Skull King. The King is good. The Knight, not so good. Nope. Actually, I don't know what he's worth, but he's not worth too much. Oh, whoops. Fossil Fusion, that's cool. So I guess people were hyped about him, and their price is probably still a little bit high. I would think they would go down a little bit, because it's... I seem to be pulling them a lot. I'm a small sample size, though. I've only opened a few packs. Maybe I'm just getting lucky. Fossil Warrior Skull Bone. That's probably the case. I'm just getting a little bit lucky and pulling a lot of good ones. Like, can you imagine if you pulled a bunch of Armageddons? That'd be sweet. Solomon Great Sunlight Wolf. Specimen Inspection. This bo Oh, that was weird. That one up opened up super weird. Maybe it has the starlight in it. Thank you, please. Afterglow. Blizzard Wolf. I feel like we've seen that guy a lot. Come on. Battles of Legend Armageddon. By the way, guys, if you guys want to see Rise of the Duelist, I will be doing some Rise of the Duelist as well. And hopefully a lot. Because I, I hear it's going to be pretty good. So I'm, I'm planning on getting some. There we go. Cross Sheep. Oh, and another nice one. The Trishula, the Dragon of Icy Imprisonment. This is only the second printing. Its first printing was a jump promo that I actually got in that collection I had the other day. The $4,000 collection. Check it out up there. Uh, they had the original jump promo version. I was like, hey, wait a second. They just reprinted this. That's pretty cool. So that one's worth a few dollars, I think. Um, Shining Fire Wingman. Darkness Metal, the Dragon of Dark Steel. That's pretty cool. First box is going, I'd say, pretty well. We haven't pulled anything huge yet. Pulled some decent stuff, though. Blackwing. Fossil Warrior Skull King. There's the guy. 
We, we this is our sixth time pulling him, so I don't know if he's that great, but he's his money wise he's good, but he's not very rare it looks like, which is interesting. Fossil Dragon Skelgios. Uh, that's weird because the uh, the first four times we had pulled him back to back. If we had pulled it back to back again, that would have been weird, really weird. Invoked Driver and Iceberg Narwhal. Iceberg Narwhal. Wow. I just realized what that said. I read it earlier, and I didn't quite comprehend that it's an Iceberg Narwhal. That's kind of crazy. <laughs> Invoked. See? Oh, wow. Wait, isn't this the Hearth Chaos Dragon? Is this a version of the Cosmo Blazer? Um, the Cosmo Blazer cover card? Or is that... I know it's like Hearth Earth something. I've never opened much Cosmo Blazer, so I don't really know too much about it. Oh, whoops. Powerful Crawler. It's a nice secret. Two packs left in this booster box. Can we get something epic? Come on. Numeron Wall. Oh, Numeron Wall. That, that was a good one. I need to pull that out. And number C1. Another good one. I haven't been pulling out Numeron Walls. So I'll go back through at the end and pull them out. But I saw when I rechecked the price that this guy is a few dollars as an Ultra as well. So I'll pull that one out. You guys can let me know when I missed them or if I missed them. I'm sure I at least missed one. Well, we've only pulled one Artifact Sanctum, so maybe I haven't. Go ahead, Defender. Book of Moon. Judgment, the Dragon of Heaven. It's pretty cool. I'm going to sleeve it up just because I like how it looks. I think it looks really cool. It's also one of the pack arts, so that's really nice. Okay, next box. No luck on Starlights yet, but on the bright side, we have two more boxes and we have a whole case. So maybe we can pull at least one of the uh, two Starlights. I mean, the dream is that we pull one in this video, then I open up my case and we pull another one. That's the dream. The chances of that happening, or even pulling one, are not even that good. They're not, like, barely over 50%. Well, the chances of us pulling one is over 50%. Pulling two is unlikely. Very unlikely. But we're still going to try. Because we want them. We want the Utopia. We want the 10,000 Dragon. And it would be a lot of fun. So, so far, one Chaos Emperor Dragon. What is it called? The Dragon of Armageddon. So far, we've gotten one. Can we make it two? Or a starlight. One of the one of those options. Oops. Let's see what we can do. Number four, armored white bear. Also, when I open the case, I'm gonna be doing it with Chelsea. She's gonna be helping me out so it doesn't take hours. So I think that'll be fun. And probably no face camp numeron wall and camera check fleet dragon because we're gonna do it where I have more room. I can't really do it in my my normal area when I have a video with Chelsea, we just don't have enough room. So I have to go downstairs and do it. So we, don't, we won't have the face cam, but it'll still be epic. Book of Moon, number F0. Kind of like when I did the Toon Chaos with Vintage Yu-Gi-Oh. It worked out pretty good, actually. And you guys seem to like that. So we're going to do a full case opening. It's going to be pretty cool. Powerful Crawler. This is definitely going to be a long video. Probably like 30 to 40 minutes. Definitely over 30 minutes. Artifact Sanctum, nice. Fossil Warrior Skull Knight. So that's our, what, second or third Artifact Sanctum? We haven't pulled too many of them, but it's a nice Ultra Rare. Definitely shorted, you can tell. We pulled <laughs> we pulled twice as many Secret Rare of the $15 Seeker than we pulled of that card in Ultra Rare. Quacky Mirror, Fossil Fusion. All right. Next pack. Can we get... The, whatchamacallit? What's it called? The uh, Skull Dome? No, not, not that, not that. The Starlight, or the 10k, what, they call it the 10k rarity? I'm sure they'll, well, I don't know if they'll give it a real name or not. It's basically a Starlight with a red name, so it's a Starlight to me. Specimen Inspection. We haven't pulled the Numeron cards in a while. Like the big ones. Maybe they are a little bit short printed. I thought I'd heard that they are not, so maybe, maybe we're just getting unlucky with those. We're pulling all of them on the, uh, what's it called? The Skull Knight. Or the Skull King, wait. No, it's the Knight that's good. Oh, I'm dumb. Yeah, the Knight is good, not the King. Whoops. Medolce and Jelly. There we go. Okay, I can't read. This is the good one. We've only pulled two of them. That's why. Okay, it all makes more sense now. The King is not the expensive one. It's the Knight. And we've pulled six Kings and two Knights. So it, it's making more sense now. Making much more sense. Whoops. Number C1. Now, this is definitely the good one, right? Number C1, Numeron, yes. This is definitely a good one. We've pulled a lot of those still. All 
All right. After glow, fossil dragon skull gar. We want the knight, not the gar. And we want the chaos emperor dragon. We pulled it early, and we've not pulled it since. High rate draw. It would be fantastic to pull one that didn't have a bunch of junk on the back. One is better than zero, though. Can't complain. In number C92. Secret rare. Wow, so we've been through a lot of this box. So far, Starlight, nowhere to be seen. No Utopia, no 10,000 Dragon. Special Beast. Yeah, the Ghosts and the Starlights recently have been hiding from us, which is unfortunate. We've been hiding. We really want to pull something epic. Even the Collector's Rares. Well, we did pull one. Oh, there's Numeron Wall and Danger Jackalope. That's a pretty good pack. A couple of good cards. A nice Ultra Rare and a nice Secret Rare Jackalope. Okay. Also, I, I'm glad that they added the Starlights into the side sets because they'd never done that before. They had always Book of Moon. They'd always just had the whole Secrets and Ultras and that's it. Because if that's all they had had, I probably would not be opening like a full case. I wouldn't open much of this set at all. Just because it just wouldn't be interesting to not have a big card to chase. I mean, we would look for the, the Chaos Emperor Dragon, but it wouldn't be that hard to pull because I mean, we already pulled it. Go fossil warrior skull bone. What are we down to? Okay, five packs left of the second box. Then we have one more box, and then we're done until the case, which we'll get here. Not sure when. Power crawler. So it's looking. Uh, it's not looking too good. Can we pull something epic? Come on. Numeron calling. There we go. There's the uh, there's the top Numeron calling card. It's about twenty bucks. Calling cards. See what I did there. Okay, three cards left. Three packs, I should say. Oops. Throwing stuff everywhere. Let's see what we can do. Oh, specimen inspection. Come on, give us that 10k dragon. So the pack trick hadn't taken too long in this. It's not too bad. Oh, whoops. Oh, O-Lion. There's another O-Lion. We don't have too many of him. Ultra rare. Last pack of this box. Let's see if we can pull... Starlight Rare. 10,000 Dragon. Let's go. Glacial Beast. Blizzard Wolf. Okay. We're on to the last 24 packs. We've almost opened 100 packs at this point. What have we opened? We've opened 40 plus 48. We've opened 88 packs. we got 24 to go. Whew. Wish us luck, guys. We need some luck. Pull the Starlight Rare. A Starlight Rare. Any of them. Either of them. If you consider 10,000, the Starlight Rare. Okay, this is not coming out very well. There we go. All right, last box. Chelsea just came in to give me the grocery update. So maybe that will give us luck. The gro she bought some B-dubs sauce at Walmart. So maybe that will, maybe that will give us some epic luck. Let me know in the comments, do you like B-dubs? If you even know what B-dubs is, first of all, you have to know what B-dubs is. If you do, then you can answer if you like it or not. Penguin. Numeron calling. Okay, good start to this box. Very good start. There we go. Is that our third one? Is that a playset? Good start. Now let's get, let's get a starlight to end it. Give us the power. Do we need to bring in the chocolates? Let me know in the comments. Come on. Madolce and Jelly. A very good start to this box. Back-to-back -back solid secret rares. Now where the Chaos Emperor? The starlights. The number 1,000 dragon. Not number. Numeron Network. Wow, this is a really good start. Wait, which one is this? No, this is the higher one. This is better than calling. Okay, wow, that was a really good start to this box. Do we get the best box ever? That's the question. Can we keep it up? Three straight packs. Oh, 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 lion. Nice. Okay, so we got a nice card. So we've gotten a good card in every pack so far. Four, stri four straight packs. Mega Phantom Beast, oh, lion. Next. See what we can do. Come on. Raw's Disciple. Oh. So we did we ended the streak. That was a good start to this box, though. I have a good feeling. Really good feeling about this box. Now give us something really incredible. Best box ever. High rate draw. Whew. Okay. Okay. We're almost to the hundredth pack. We're getting close. So 100 packs equals. 
the what the ten thousand dragons. Is that how that works? Fossil dragon Skullgar. Okay, how many packs do we have left? Let's see. Seventeen. Okay. Come on. Give us the fire in the last box. Can we pull the absolute fire dart spell regeneration? <sighs> We're getting close to the end. We still have, we do have more coming, but we still want to pull the fire here. Oh, Numeron Wall, nice. Book of Moon, that's not bad. Oh, and the Skull King. Oh, never mind, he's not good. I forgot, it's Skull Knight, not King. Okay, Numeron Wall, Book of Moon. I don't think that's worth too much, but I'm pulling him out. For GOAT, just to throw in my GOAT format stashes, I, I stash GOAT format cards. No matter what printing, I just throw them in there together. Time Stream, I don't, have we seen that card? I don't remember Time Stream. That's weird. Okay. Come on, Utopia. Wait, what was that? Polar Penguin. 10,000 Dragon, 10K, just like the 10K special. If you didn't watch that, every pack opening, make sure you go watch that. I'm sure you guys all watched it, but Cross Sheep, okay, and the Trishula. That's a pretty good pack. Cross Sheep, nice ultra rare, and then the Trishula. That is also a good pull. The Dragon of Icy Imprisonment. All right. Come on. Come on! Darkness, Metal, the Dragon of Dark Steel. Come on, guys. Believe. Hit the like button for luck. We need the luck. We need it. We need it! Fossil Warrior Skull King again. I wish that guy was the expensive one. I have so many of them. Oh, whoops. That just shredded. Okay. Fossil Dragon Skull Gaios. What do we have? We're, oh, we're down to the last 10 or so packs. Maybe even a little bit less. Can the Starlight save us on the last pack? Invoked. The Narwhal. The Iceberg Narwhal. Okay. Okay. Okay, believe, guys. Here we go. Whew. Believe in the power. Invoked. Number C92. What do we have left? Seven packs. Whew. We've opened over 100 packs. Can we pull the absolute fire out of here? Powered Crawler, six packs left. The countdown is now. Come on, Steam Synchron, Numeron Wall. And number C1, our friend meets us again. Another good pack because we pulled C1 and we pulled Numeron Wall, that's very good. Five packs remaining in this massive opening. I hope you guys have enjoyed the longer video. The newest set, Battles of Legend, Armageddon. Okay, come on. Book of Moon again. Judgment Dragon, the Dragon of Heaven. That's a cool one. And a Book of Moon. Four packs. We've only pulled one Armageddon, too. This is crazy. And we haven't pulled any of the uh, Invocation. Wow. Wow. Artifact Ignition, again. Phew. Our only Chaos Emperor Dragon is going to have the crap on the back, too. That is unfortunate. Come on, Starlight. <sighs> Believe, guys. Here we go. Oh, Danger Jackalope. That's good. Two packs left. Do you believe that we can do this? Do you believe that we can do this? In the last pack. We've had great last pack magic recently. By the way, you can't scale these for whenever we pull something awesome. Yeah, because somebody will be like, You scaled the last pack. Artifact Sanctum. Awesome. F is zero. You scaled the last pack so that it would guarantee to have something good in it so you could take clickbait. Yeah, that's that's not happening. But what is happening is this epic prismatic. Here we go. <sighs> Chaos Neos. Socket Roll. Go Yo Guardian. Penguin Torpedo. And number C92. So that's it. Wow. So I'm glad I brought those blisters in because we did get the uh, Chaos Ember Dragon. Let's go over what we got. We got, I mean, there's a lot of great value in here, so it's a pretty good set. We didn't even pull, we didn't pull everything, and we opened over 100 packs. Cross Sheep, um, well, I mean, that's, I mean, you can't pull everything, but we did pretty well, I think. We pulled, okay, the Skull Knights, this guy's not actually worth anything. I just, the whole time, thought it was. Numeron Walls, C1s, so I probably missed some other decent $2 cards and stuff. I'll go back through and check after the video. But yeah, make sure you guys like the video and subscribe for the 20,000 subscriber. Don't forget that guy, our best pull. 
opening and of course the giveaway so yeah thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys later peace Elemental Hero, Dark Bright, Boom! Oh, <laughs>